Phil, how is Phil? Well, Phil's actually away at the minute, so oh, it was, it was the rest of the team. He's with Lee in uh, in Romania. They're in. Lee and Keen are competing, so the lads are out there. So, nice. but straight away, you know what I mean? Like that, you know, it's, it'll be the same when I'm grappling, same when I can kick. Yeah. I, I'm eager to get back, you know what I mean? I'm eager to get back and get going. Do you even assign yourself a date at this point? Or are you just going to go, look, let's take nah, a date? Yeah, no, nah, nah. I'm, I'm not assigning a date. I'd say late summer. Yeah. Late summer. Because see, you know, you see what happens. I'd say late summer, I could. Yeah. But I want, I, you know, I'm going to be true to myself. Yeah. I'm going to be bringing bring out the best of myself, you know what I mean? So I want to do, I'm going to do this for my fans, you know what I mean? I'm doing this for the people that are supporting me, you know what I mean? So I want to show up the best I can possibly be. And I will, I will be. Do you think... Do you find it strange that people kind of always, I, I always feel like they're feathering the nest where they, they, they think they're going to be disappointed so they're trying to set it up so it won't hurt as much. Do you yeah. find it weird that people are always like, oh he's gone, he won't come back, he won't fight. Do you yeah. find it weird that? Because you've never publicly, like, you've never shown any ounce of someone mm. who wants to stop fighting. You fight as often as you're able to. Uh, people, I think people may wish that I'm, that I would just say goodbye, you know, <laughs> maybe there is a bit of that. And then there is the people that would, not, would, would do it that way also, your way, what you were saying. I'm sure it's a bit of both, for sure. Yeah. Are you excited? I'm very excited. Really I'm very. Excited. There's, 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 there's history to be made. The game is to be shook up again. The Triple Crown has never been done. It'll never be done in my lifetime. No one will do this in my lifetime. You know what I mean? To win three... If I, it's not if, when I knock Kamara Usman out at 170. That'll be three UFC World Titles won, moving upward with three knockouts. Yeah. I knocked out Aldo, I knocked out Alvarez, and knock out Kamara Usman. Three knockouts, three world titles, three weights going up. Champ, That's champ, it. champ. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'll figure out something more catchy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll, let it, I'll let you know, catch, I'll, let, I'll figure out a catchy one for a book. I'll end on one question. Yeah. You mentioned at the beginning of this that way back in the day you tried to sneak in here underage. Did you have a go to move? Did you climb over the back wall? The back wall was called the cast or back wall? Yeah, how are you know? Because I scoped it out for <laughs> how I'd have done it. Yeah, well, not yourself, but yeah. He, Liam, who, was, who used to own the pub, he used to own like 20% of the pub and another guy, Mick, used to own 70%. So I bought 100% off both of them. Yeah. And I re-employed Liam, who owned the 20%, gave him a raise, you know, gave him incent incentivized him to, if the pub does well, he does even better. You know, they're all, all the staff here are incentivized, the chef is incentivized, everyone, you know, everyone's, everyone's hard at work here to make this a success and it is a roaring success, you know what I mean? Everything, everything is cream of the crop here. But the other day, or a couple of weeks back, Liam put up uh, a picture of the staff, him and his staff outside, outside the front door, and he was standing there and he was like, this was the, this was the place where Connor came as a young lad, and he was telling me about his dreams of the future. You know, one of these type of things. I know you wrote underneath it. I was just trying to get into the place, Liam. <laughs> you know, when you show up, you're trying to, you're trying to, you're trying to. Oh, trying to, oh I know Dave, Dave's coming. <laughs> yeah, you know, people do that about me. Come on, this, oh, people yeah, name drop, it doesn't work. Yeah. It's actually the worst thing you can do. It's name drop you in nah, It's probably the worst thing you can do is yeah. name drop me because just, it just it backs people up. But you know, when you roll up to the door and you're trying to keep a straight face, or you're trying to be extra nice to get in, that was me. I was filling him with all sorts trying to get in. <laughs> <laughs> just trying to get into the place, but I, I, I look, I end up, you know, it's, it's been some journey. Yeah. It's great, great to still, ha great to be, you know, in, in business with him on, on another level now, and everything's just going great, man. You know what I mean? Just a long may it continue. Got the family here. We're trying out the St. Patrick's Day menu. Got to making a great video that's going to go out later on this evening. You know, I want to show the world the proper Irish cuisine. I want to show, the, I want to show the world like I've always wanted to show the world Irish quality. You know what I mean? At first, I was it was to introduce the Irish public to martial arts. We knew about boxing. We didn't know about the rest of the game. We didn't know about true fighting. You know, and then and then it was to introduce the world about Irish fighting. You know what I mean? Now now it's to introduce the world about Irish cuisine, Irish uh, Irish stout, Irish whiskey, and all the rest of it. And then of course. I'm still swinging leather, you know, <laughs> till the day I go out, make no mistake about that. Conor McGregor, thank you very much. Oscar, my man, I, you know, I hope, you know, I know you're enjoying that, I see the buzz on you, man. <laughs> we can't wait to, uh, we I can't wait. One <laughs> He's at the down now, but there. Uh, well, uh, you know, I'm going to have a great, I'm going to have a same, great St. Patrick's Day uh, tomorrow. I'm, we're waking up, I'm going to train tonight for the second session of the day, you know, two days I'm at now again. So, uh, now that, because, you know, now that I have, thing, now that I can do a lot more. Yeah, yeah. So I have another session tonight. I'm going to bring the kids to the parade early tomorrow morning. Enjoy that with the family, and then I'm going to come back here, nice Irish cuisine, and then a party. You know what I mean? So if you're here, if you're here or not, yeah. I'll be here okay. celebrating, my man. All right. God bless. Happy St. Patrick's Day to you. Happy enjoy, enjoy UFC London as well.